What is up y'all? Hi, if you're new, my name is Brittany Monet. So in today's video, we are going hygiene shopping. I'm super excited because I haven't been hygiene shopping in forever. I had COVID and stuff like that, so I couldn't even go into Target and stuff. But I'm all better now, so we're going to see what we can find at Target. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of new products that are out, so let's just get right into it. Okay, so if you've been on TikTok, then you know it's a trend for black girls to tan. So I kind of want to try this face and body. It is $19.99, and they also have a L'Oreal one, so I'm not really sure, but I think I'm going to pick this one up. This is the medium, and they have a light one in the back, and then they have medium and dark, and then they have these glow ones. So yeah, $19.99. I'm going to pick this up, put it in the car. And then I have to get my OG Mighty Patches, 24 in a pack, $7.99. So yeah, I'm going to pick two of these up. And then it seems like this is the last one. So I'm going to pick up this Urban Hydration Bright and Balanced Aloe Vera and Face and Body Soap. So yeah, I'm going to pick this up. And I also picked up these Camille Rose Grow Back Drops, which it's kind of, they kind of compare it to the Myel Rosemary Drops. So I just want to see which one is better. So yeah, I picked that up as well. So that's what we have in the cart so far. And then I'm going to go over to Body Care. And y'all, I always rave about La Rose Pose and their moisturizing cream is the best. I already have one and I'm not done with it, but this is really good. I think it's like 20 something dollars, but y'all should pick this up if you need a moisturizer that really moisturizes your skin and it's for eczema. So yeah, y'all need to pick this. Okay, so the last time I was at Target, I was eyeing this Vaseline spray moisturizer. This is the Coco Radiant. It is $5.99, so I'm just gonna get this. Um, I also have the Coco Radiant Body, the, um, the Vaseline Jelly, which I really like. And then I also have the body oil. And I can't find it at my house, but this one is $6.49 and the lotion is $8.49. I'm just gonna put this in there. And if y'all have any type of bumpy skin, like the KP bumps, y'all need to get this. It also has lactic acid in it. And I love it so much. It is $17.29. So these are the my favorite lotion when it comes to exfoliating my skin. Okay, I also needed to pick up a new baby unscented. I use this to base clean and also to clean my downstairs area. I do not use honey pot and all those other um, washes that are targeted towards washing your downstairs area. So yeah, I only use gentle body washes to clean down there. So this is what we got so far. And I think that's all I need in this section. Oh, and I really love this Olay Balancing and Evening Skin um, Body Wash. This is the Vitamin C and Apple Cider Vinegar. It's $7.99, love it so much. I haven't tried this one yet. And then I'm also using this Vitamin C Body Wash. $7.99. Honestly, Olay is my favorite body wash company. So yeah, love this one. The vitamin C one and then the retinol one is pretty good as well. And then this is one of my OG drugstore KP body scrubs. Glyconic acid is your friend. I also love this Olay body conditioner as well. These are the prices. Okay, so this is what I got in my cart so far. I also picked up this Sun Balm face mist. I needed something that I could just spray on that doesn't leave a white cast. And yeah, so just to reapply my sunscreen. So yeah, I heard some good reviews about this on TikTok. And then also I need to pick up another one of these Olay Retinol. One of my favorites. You can only use it at nighttime, but I really love it. So I'm going to get that as well. Okay, so this is another product that you can use instead of using Honey Pot because I know if you have been looking on TikTok, then you know there was like a scandal and stuff. So yeah, you can use these. And honestly, gynecologists recommend that you don't use Honey Pot and those type of brands anyway. So yeah, they recommend using stuff like this or just water. So yeah, these are some good choices to um, start using instead of using Honey Pot. 
Okay, y'all, so I'm gonna get these L'Oreal ones instead. And these are only $10.99 and it comes with a free tinted self lotion. So I'm gonna try both of these out at the same time. So yeah, only $10.99. So I'm gonna put the one, the other one back that's $19.99. And I feel like this would be better for someone of color anyway. So I'm not really sure if the medium one would work out for this one. So yeah, I'm gonna get this instead. Y'all, and I've always wanted blue hair. So I'm just gonna get this temporary color by As I Am. It's only $7.99, so I'm gonna put that in the cart as well. Okay, so I absolutely love the Dermalogica Daily Micro Exfoliant. I already have two in my cart. If I don't use these, I break out. So I love these so much, so I got that. It's the best selling. Okay, yeah, and I stopped using Tree Hut because it broke me out. The only one that I still love is the strawberry one, but other than that, I don't use Tree Hut. And honestly, I really don't even use the strawberry one anymore. But yeah, this one right here broke me out. I don't know if I was the only one, but yeah. And I do like the vitamin C one. That one didn't break me out. So the only two that I would recommend if you have sensitive skin is the vitamin C and then the strawberry one. So this is cool. Hemp's has this body cleansing oil, which I've never used an oil to cleanse my body. But yeah, I really do love Hemp's. Um, they, their lotions smell really good and very long lasting. And yeah, um, I was trying to find the, the new collection, but I guess it's not sold at Ulta yet. But the one that I've always loved is this sweet pineapple and honey melon that's my favorite one and then i think i've tried another one but that's really the one that i like oh and then there was another collection but it's only seasonal they don't have it anymore y'all i was wondering when black girl sunscreen was gonna come out with a spray and they finally did i'm not really sure if it's um invisible or not it just says continuous which that kind of makes me sound like it might be invisible but um yeah they have the this is 30 percent or 30 spf face and body and i've used this one i really like it i haven't used it in a while because i lost it but yeah they have it i'm so excited and it is 15.99 and I'm kind of upset because I just bought this Sun Balm one at Target. So I'm not really sure if I want to get this or not, but I'm just excited that they finally have one. But I'm not sure if it's um, invisible, which is really what I want, because I don't want to have to rub it in. But yeah, they have that, so y'all, it's not at Target, so you have to get it at Ulta. Okay, so I'm back at home. I just want to show you guys all the products that I got. So I went to Target first and then I went to Ulta. Is this Olay Retinol Body Wash. I really love this stuff. This is one of my favorite Olay body washes. Um, retinol is just really good for helping with fine lines, wrinkles. Um, I think acne, maybe like body acne and um, like dark marks and stuff. So it just really helps. And yeah, it smells really good. Um, so yeah, that's the first thing that I got. Okay, and then I decided to get the Urban Hydration Aloe Vera Body Wash, um, body face and body soap. Um, I've tried this brand before, but this is for your body as well. And I guess aloe vera helps with eczema, um, acne, and all that type of stuff. So I'll try this out. You know, I do have pimples on my face or like acne i have acne prone skin so we'll see if this helps with acne since it claims that it does but i think i should have bought two one for my face one for my body but i think for right now i might just use it on my body because i have something for my face so yeah i bought this and then i got the vaseline intensive care spray moisturizer i've never had a spray moisturizer before but i'm gonna try this out it's non-greasy so i like that it's very light and it's just a continuous spray so yeah um i'm gonna try this out and i just want a glow for the summer so this is something that I got. We'll try it. Next, I got the Dr. Bronner's um, Baby Castile Soap or Pure Castile Soap. This is the Baby Unscented. I use this all the time. I use it to base clean and to clean my downstairs area. So I really like this. It doesn't have a smell to it. And unlike the other ones, it doesn't, um, like, it's the peppermint one that kind of 
is this too strong especially for someone who has sensitive skin so i use these so next i got the l'oreal paris um subline bronze this is the self tanning facial drops and you just mix it in with your moisturizer for a sun kissed glow and yes yeah, so and then it came with the um the body tan as well so this is for your face and then this one is for your body so i just like how it was a free gift so i could try it out so yeah if you've been if you're on tiktok then you know about this trying to tan and stuff so yeah i got this and it's with hyaluronic acid and i have acne prone skin so hopefully it will not break me out and it said that it's suitable for sensitive skin so we'll see how i like it um yeah so we'll see and hopefully it can like cover up the little dark marks that i have so that's really why i wanted to try it out so we got this and then i got some more mighty patches because like i said i break out and they're really good and then i got the as i am cool blue temporary color i'm gonna use this um probably tomorrow um i stopped dyeing my hair so i wanted but i do want color so i'm just gonna use this i've tried a couple of brands but i've never done blue before so we'll see like ever i've never done blue so we'll see how that looks on me and then the last thing that i got from target is this sun bum face mist and i kind of want to try it now I'm scared has like it smells good but i like how um it doesn't leave a white cast i don't have to rub it in it's just something quick um this is the 45 spf um and then it's enriched with witch hazel <coughs> it does have a <coughs> it has a strong scent to it kind of but that's all that i got at least a glow that's all that I got from Target and then I'm gonna show you. I only got two things from Ulta, but yeah. So from Ulta, I got the Daily Micro Exfoliant. This is from Dermalogica. This is my all-time favorite cleanser. It really helps with um, my acne. And when I don't use it, I can tell the difference. Like my acne just pops up. And then I got this. This is the Black Girl Sunscreen. I was like so excited to see it at Ulta because when I was in Target, I was wondering if they were gonna come out with one, I was thinking that in my head because obviously this is a trend right now to spray on sunscreen. So I was just wondering when they were gonna come out with one. And then I found an Ulta and I just didn't know they had one. So yeah, um, it is SPF 30 for face and body. So we're just gonna see. I have like, not makeup on, but just like, you know, um, blush and stuff. So we'll see if it's, if I'm able to just spray it on. It's hard to spray it out though. Mm. Oh, it burns like low key. I don't like how, like, ugh. it's sticky for one and it burns kind of. I don't know if it's because. I don't like this one. I don't know. I'm gonna have to keep giving it a try, I guess, but I don't like how you can't just, you know, mist it like how the other one was. Even though both of them have strong scents, this one smells way like, this one smells like sunscreen. The other one has like, like a nice scent to it, but it's strong. I don't know. This one is just like, just look how I look. I don't know i'm gonna try it out again i just don't like how it's hard like you can't just mist it maybe i need it to back up more but yeah so that's all that i got from ulta okay so this is what it looks like um it's kind of dry i mean it's my fault that i was spraying it so close to my face or whatever but um i don't know 
my face is usually dry so i guess i can get away with this but if you have oily skin i don't think that i would recommend this um spray but um it doesn't sting anymore i think it was just because <clears throat> i sprayed it too close to my face but yeah this is the black girl sunscreen it's kind of oily on my forehead though but yeah i don't know what do you guys think i think i like it it just at first it kind of stung like a little when i was spraying it on but it doesn't itch or sting anymore so yeah that's the two sunscreens that I bought, the spray ones. I honestly think I like the Sun Bum better just because it's more of a mist. Um, the other one, it kind of just sprayed out kind of like aggressively. But yeah, those are the two sunscreens that I got. So if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And comment down below if you want me to review any of these products. Um, all of these, for the most part, are new to me. Um... So yeah, just let me know if you want to see a review on them. So I'll catch y'all in my next video. Me, between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be.